<laughs> yes. Oh, Maserati. Yes. So that also now, <laughs> after five times on his back, he still comes and really positions him here. Uh, that is very good feedback for me. Yes. Oh, Maserati. It really tells me he's still happy to do all that. Yes, if a horse suddenly decides, okay, I really don't want to stand at the mounting block anymore, I'd rather you not get on, it means, oops, I might have done something wrong. I might have pushed the horse too much. If the horse still comes, position himself. Your mozzie, huh? That was a bit quicker than usual, huh? <laughs> so last time when I got on, he caught my chap and held my foot. And I said, okay, good, maybe I have to speed that whole process a bit up. Uh -huh. Give him some time to think here now. Rub him, breathe, really calm. Because here, um, we're installing a habit for life. Uh -huh. Right here in the first time is mounting. The horse is learning about being patient and really calm and relaxed at the mounting block. This is not something the horse learns after 50 rides. <laughs> this is something the horse learns right at the beginning. Right at the beginning, the horse learns about how things are done when riding. <laughs> so, and I need to have in my head, how would I like my future dream horse to behave like? And I would like my future dream horse to pick me up at the mounting block, <laughs> to stand patiently and calmly relax for mounting, and to wait until I ask him to walk off. Huh? Good guy. Huh? Oh, flexion. Hey, Mazi. Hi, Mazi. Mm -hmm. Other side. Hi, Mazi. You're my colonel. Here we have to look at you. And yeah. Now let's see if we can walk off. Huh? Good boy. Very cool. Just walked. Huh? Good boy. He needs to look. That's okay. That's okay. So I felt him here uh, turning around and having to have a look because he was a bit, uh, I don't know, insecure about something. And then if in that moment I push the horse forward, <laughs> the horse doesn't feel seen and gets confirmed in the worry. Mm -hmm. So that's why I just now allowed him to have a look, reassure him, and this really promptly a big yawn followed. Yes, huh? You're my cleaner. Yeah. Yeah. Even if, uh, you know, horses are bred since generations in captivity and are domesticated and none of his ancestors in close, uh, in the close past have been wild horses, you know, a horse remains a horse in its core. And even though he is super confident with me and stuff, this still triggers his innate nature as a prey animal. We can never, never, never forget this element. Huh? Oh. Hi, Koda. This 
What? <laughs> you really like your goth strap, huh? Come. Good boy. Yes, very good boy. Yo. Yeah. Do that again, Mazi. Come. Very good boy. Super. Yeah. Come. Another one. Good boy. Yeah, big yawning. <laughs> He's processing a lot today, I have the feeling. So maybe <gasps> I will change my plan and not go all the way where I wanted to go today. Just because I have the feeling today is big time processing day. Ah, oh, my man. Yes. So if I compare how he is and how Tara was for her start, Tara was in the beginning a bit less confident. But um, yeah, she needed a bit longer to be okay with me on her back. Um, but she was each time like, okay, good, I can do that. If you, if you trust I can do that, I can do that. All right, that's fine. And he turns out to really have to think about everything a lot of time, a long time. Hmm? No, there's no way we can rush the process of a youngster getting confident about the tall riding thing. Hmm? Hmm? You can play that game with me on your back too, huh? Yeah. Super. Very good. And bend to a stop. Very nice and slow. Disengage. Emergency drill. Good boy. So if we practice the emergency drill. <laughs> good boy. I am not kind of trucking the horse's head around. Do it really nice and slow. With the focus on the horse relaxing. Oh boy. And reconnecting to me. Oh. Good guy. Super. Good boy. Good. Good, Good boy. Good boy. Super good and emergency drill. Good boy. Yeah, you're so good. Huh? Oh, bent to stop. Yeah. Good guy. Huh? Good boy. I don't really care where he goes. Yeah. Just that he does keep trotting a bit. He doesn't stop at the tarp. Yep. Yep. Good boy. Yep. Super. Very good boy. And stop to the right. Good guy. Huh? Bring your nose around without biting my chaps. Yes. Oh boy. Rub his face until he can relax. Oh boy. Yeah, there. I really like this trot much better. He picked it easier. He was really thinking more about trotting. Uh -huh. So and at that stage of the, the, the start on the saddle, it's uh, the stage is called accept the rider <laughs> and this does not only include the first mounting it also includes to accept the rider to walk and trot as a passenger 
This is why I don't really care where he goes so much yet. I'm gonna keep him safe, of course. I'm gonna keep him from getting stuck in corners, from getting stuck on the arena wall, looking to the outside. And I'm gonna keep him from running into the objects here. <laughs> but I don't really care where he goes so much yet. I just care about that we establish basic communication about going forward and stopping, and that he's confident with walking and trotting with me on his back. Well, my Z-man. I'll leave it on that, huh? It was already better. Oh boy. Oh god. So I'm gonna leave him on this, my Z-man. Get off. Good boy, huh? Yeah. Good guy. Yeah. And uh, so we can't force a youngster. <laughs> to get confident immediately. Some need a bit longer time to process that, well, he needs a bit longer time to get confident with the trotting experience, obviously. Um, so we need to give the horse the time. As soon as he start pushing, this is when problems start. And uh, so if you ha can have help from the ground to get a lunge your horse, it's gonna be a bit easier. Uh, but uh, just, I think it's a really nice example um, progression is not always linear and we cannot always go to the next step we have been planning and today I just repeated what I did actually last time um, that he gets confident with me trotting on his back and he picked the trot much easier very happy about this and the last trot he felt really confident also that he was not just running in a circle but actually exploring behind the barrel and coming back and going a bit to the right it was really nice I'm as happy. Yeah, I'm kleiner, huh? And like this, we build confidence and understanding step by step in each session. I'm as happy. Okay, so if you have any question about this session, please feel free to ask. And otherwise, see you next time. Mozi man, huh?